Cesc Fabregas has achieved more in his 27 years than most players can dream of in their entire career. He's won the World Cup, two Euros, La Liga titles, plenty more besides. And this weekend, it's another momentous occasion in his already storied career as he comes up against his old club, Arsenal, for the very first time. So, what do Gunners fans think of his move to Chelsea? And where does it rank in terms of the most contentious moves in the history of the Premier League? Well, we came to the Emirates to find out more. If you could sum up in one word how you felt when you heard that Cesc Fabregas had signed for Chelsea, what word would you pick? One word. Confused. It was gay, mate. Gutty. Judas. There's a lot of sadness. Sadness. Sadness, sadness yeah. Upset. How about you? Gutted. Gutted. Disappointed. Upset. Gutted. A little bit shocked, I guess. Surprised. Last player I really loved at Arsenal. Disappointed. I'm trying to think of a good word right now. <laughs> because he's an amazing player, but we turned down the opportunity. I don't know why we said no to a, such a talented player. Look what he's doing at Chelsea, he could be doing that here instead. He's the one that's making Chelsea click. There's no harm in having world-class players in your squad. Now Barcelona, that was his own club and we accepted that. But we thought he would stay there, maybe come back and grace the Emirates again. But for him to turn out for the, under Mourinho, it's put a bit of taste in all our mouths. Chelsea, it's like... It's just another transfer move. Personally, and I think I might be different with a lot of Arsenal fans here, but RVP going to Man United was worse. Because I hate him. RVP going to United. Robin Van Persie going to Manchester United. RVP. He engineered it. Yeah. Fabregas didn't have the choice. Of course, Cesc Fabregas isn't the first ex-Red to turn out for the Blues. Ashley Cole left Highbury trembling with anger, having been offered a paltry £55,000 a week basic wage. Poor chap. And whilst Chelsea are huge top-of-the-table rivals, Arsenal's North London rivalry with Spurs easily eclipses that for intensity and bragging rights. Sol Campbell caused the most consternation being labelled Judas as he joined the Gunners in 2001 to become part of the great Invincibles side just two years later. Wayne Rooney once wore a t-shirt with a once a blue, always a blue slogan on it after scoring for Everton, then promptly moved to Manchester United. Any residue of goodwill left at Goodison would have been wiped away when he kissed his new badge right in front of his old fans. And what a Michael Owen. He made his name as a vibrant young poacher at Liverpool, of course, before ending up at Northwest Nemesis Man United, where he basically warmed the bench for three years. At least he had the courtesy to keep off the score sheet when he came on back at Anfield. So Arsene Wenger made a big mistake not re-signing Cesc Fabregas. At least that's what most of the Arsenal fans we've spoken to tonight think. What about you? Was it a clanger? Let us know in the comments below, people. And where does Fabregas to Chelsea rank amongst the most contentious transfers in Premier League history. You want to know what you think. And if you like what you've seen, plenty more where that came from. So if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel for loads more content. We'll see you soon.